Yeah, babe? Do you know what time it is? It's 5.30. Why? What time did you tell them to get here? I told them to be here by 5. Well, you know, we probably should tell them to be here half an hour earlier. <laughs> I know. They're never on time. Well, that's good, because that leaves more time for us. And they have the worst time ever. <laughs> Hey guys. Hey, sorry we're late. Yeah, but you know how this one is. <laughs> well, hey now, Queenie. You know you liked it. Ooh, I'm telling Kristen. <laughs> Tell me what. It's that Dean and Nick are lovers. Tell me something I don't already know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Kristen, you got us all here. So what's this big news? Well, this, this isn't easy for me to say, but I've been keeping a secret from you guys for a while. Like what? Are you guys finally expecting? What? No, <laughs> no it's not good news, guys. Then what is it? I have leukemia. Yeah. Wait, hold on. Leukemia, like cancer? Oh my god. My aunt had leukemia. Didn't your aunt die? Yes, I have cancer and Yes, I am dying. You, you can't be dying. When did you find this out? About eight months ago. I passed out at work and... Why didn't you call me? How long were you there? You can't be dying. You, Isn't there anything they can do? You just can't be dying. Well, can't. I am dying and there's nothing you can do about it. Isn't there any sort of chemo or treatment? At first, the doctors didn't know what was wrong with me. I was just so tired all the time. By the time they finally figured it out, it was too advanced for anything to help. Even chemo wouldn't help. So why didn't you tell us this sooner? Because I just didn't know how to deal with it all. I needed time to come to terms with it. I'm sorry. Please, please don't. Y you know what, guys? I'm, I'm really not feeling all that well. I'm gonna go lay down. Kristen! What just happened? I don't know. I don't know. I can't believe this. Here, please. But I have to talk to her. Just let me do this. Kira, come on. Give us some time by themselves. Nick, call us. Go away. Baby, I'm not going anywhere until we talk. Nick, please go away. Baby, please. Please, just let me in. No. 
please. Unlock the door. Why didn't you tell us about this before? I just didn't want to be treated any differently. Why didn't you at least tell me? Why? Yes, why? Because if I had told you when I first found out, would you have stayed with me all this time? I can't believe- how could you even ask that question? Of course I would. I would have squeezed a whole lifetime of love these last few months. Do you really mean that? I do. I grow old with you. I'm so sorry. I love you. So what happened last night? Well... We talked... Are you okay? <laughs> yeah. It's just hard for me to accept. So what do we do now? I don't know. We just got to make the most of the time we have left with her. I still can't believe this is all happening. No. How are you dealing with all of this? I'm okay. I asked her why she didn't tell me. And what did she say? She said that she told me she didn't think I was going to stay with her. That's just crazy. You two love each other. Of course you'd stay. I know. Guess she just was afraid of being left alone. I mean, we're her only family. You know, she told me something else before I left this morning. What did she say? She said before she she wants to go to the beach one last time. I mean, with all of us. So, when are we gonna take her? This weekend. Is that okay? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Guys, I have, I have to go to work now. favor to ask you. Sure, man. What's up? Do you think that you could bring your video camera to the beach with us? You got it, man. Hey, dude. What's up? What? We 
Where's Nick? Here he is. I'm here now, baby. How long has she been like this? I don't know. She was like this when we got here. Well, how long have you guys been here? Uh, about an hour. An hour? You guys been here an hour? You just call me now? Don't blame them, Nick. I asked them not to call you until I had a chance to talk to Kira alone. Why? About what? About what I want her to do for me when I'm gone. <laughs> Baby, please, don't say that. Please. I want you two to take care of each other. No. Please. Get married no. and have a family. Baby, please. Don't. Nick, we knew this day was coming. I know. I still don't want you to die. Just promise that you'll do this for me. We promise. Stress, expecting nothing more and nothing less from a world that's changing shape a generation's heart so torn apart and straying about to break. Fine. 